Hey, what is going on everyone? This is I Reviews back with another video and today I will show you guys my top 10 must have iPhone apps of 2019. These are all free apps that can be downloaded from the App Store and they're very useful so you must have them on your iOS device. The first app for this video is called Music Volume Booster. This app allows you to boost the music sound of your iPhone. Whether you're playing music from Spotify, Dropbox or the iTunes Media Library, which are the songs that you have on your music app, then you can go ahead and basically double the volume of your iPhone when playing music. So this is the home screen of the app right here where you will find your sources. So here you can connect Spotify, Dropbox or the iTunes Media Library. And let's just play a song from here. So here we have one playing currently. So this is the sound of the iPhone, it's at the maximum right here. But if we go here, we can go ahead and boost the volume. So let's just play it. So you can see right there with that slider at the bottom of the screen, you can go ahead and basically double the sound of your iPhone. Of course, it's not recommended to keep it all the way up at, for a long time because that of course might damage the speakers of your iPhone. The second app for the video is called WebDuo. This is basically a split screen application for your iPhone. It allows you to browse two different websites at the same time. So for example, here on the left side, I can have YouTube, I can have a video playing right there, while on the right side, I can go ahead and browse another website. You can see how easy it is to have two websites here on the same screen. This is pretty, pretty awesome. And of course the app is free, so you can have split screen mode here on the iPhone. Of course, right there, you will have at the top of your bookmarks, your favorite, and you can go home from there. And here you will have the screen split in half and two different websites that you can browse easily. The next app for the video is called Secret Files and this app allows you to hide pictures or videos from the camera roll of your iPhone. It's pretty easy to use so you go ahead, go to the settings first and you will set a passcode which you will use to protect these files that you hide within this app. Then you want to go ahead and basically like hide a picture or a video. All you got to do here is create a folder or go to an existing folder which you might have and then just tap the plus button right there which will take you to the camera roll where you can choose your picture or video that you want to hide. Once you choose the picture that you want to hide, it will show you this pop-up which asks you if you want to delete it from the camera roll. This way, this photo will be deleted from there and will be only saved within this app. Of course, you click here, delete, so the picture is only here and protected with a passcode. So later on, if you want to restore it to the camera roll, of course, all you got to do is just swipe like this and click here, save to library and enter the passcode which you use to protect these photos or videos and then it will go ahead and successfully restore it to the camera roll of your iPhone. Mobile Master is a must have app if you want to see everything regarding your device. So you want to be informed with everything like the battery, all the specifics of your iPhone, you will have everything here. So you'll have a list right here from the general information to the CPU, RAM memory, network, sensors, battery, all that. And we have some useful tools here as well. You can go ahead and download like live wallpapers from within this app. This is pretty cool. And then you also have the speed test so you can test the speed of your internet. You have a decibel meter right there. This one is pretty awesome. So you can measure the sounds right here with this decibel meter. That's one pretty cool. And you also have a ruler, you have a magnifier, all that. So you have a bunch of tools here that you can use for free. Musemage is an awesome camera app. So this app allows you to have everything in control. So you can see right here, everything will be on your control, everything on manual from the focus, you will have here the white balance, you can set the aperture, all that everything can be controlled with these sliders right here. And here, of course, you can go ahead and change between different modes, like from manual to video to photo to time lapse. Here you can see the time lapse. You can set the speed of the time lapse right there. Of course, you have also stop motion. So it's pretty, pretty cool. Everything can be controlled manually and you will have total control on the pictures that you take using this app. 1.1.1.1 is one of the most famous VPN apps that has recently been released. 
this one I mentioned in a previous video as well it's pretty awesome it will make the internet on your iPhone faster so what it does is that it uses like a kind of system like things that need to be done through your ISP will be done on your iPhone so that way it will load faster websites and things like that so it's pretty pretty awesome of course the VPN will also protect your device so you just enable it from there you can see it's pretty simple to use you just enable the switch right there so you want to disable it it will show you this pop-up where you can pause like for 15 minutes one hour or you can go ahead and disable it completely or of course you can just disable it while you're connected to your Wi-Fi sticker maker is a fun app but it's really useful as well. It allows you to create like packs of stickers that you can use on the WhatsApp app. This one is really, really awesome. So here's the home screen of the app. You can create a new sticker pack right there. So I already have one and you can set here the tray icon and then you have all these spots where you can set different stickers. So this one allows you to create stickers from the pictures that you have on the camera roll of your iPhone or you can even take a picture using your camera. Let's just choose a photo right here. So once you choose a photo from the camera roll or you take one using the camera, all you gotta do here is just cut the part which you want to make into a sticker and you can see just like that, click save and it will create a sticker which you can then go ahead and add to WhatsApp and you can send it to your friends or family using this app. It's pretty, pretty awesome. Of course, will be pretty fun to create stickers out of your pictures, your personal pictures. That will be really, really awesome. Food Vision is a must have app for everyone that wants to track the calories and what they eat during the day. So it's kind of, you can see here the interface, it looks kind of like Snapchat. What it allows you to do is that you can just basically go ahead and take a picture of the food that you're eating. So you're eating something, just launch the app, take a picture and it will show you all the details regarding that food. The calories, it will show you all the carbs, the fats, everything, the proteins, everything regarding that food. So if you go here and go to the details right here, it will show you the calories, all the nutrition for today from, for, from the food that you have eaten today. And also you will see a summary right there of the week. So it shows everything right here. What have you eaten during the week? Paper CO is, in my opinion, the best wallpaper app that you can get on your iPhone. It's really awesome and the amount of wallpapers that you can get from this app is really, really crazy. So there's a large number of different wallpapers to choose from. So this is the home screen. Like when you launch the app, you will see here the recent added wallpapers. You can see here a ton of pages. Just scroll down and you will see some really, really beautiful wallpapers. So you want to try one out, you just go tap on it. And then if you tap right here, you can see it will show you how it looks on the lock screen or the home screen of course you can tap right here to change that and you want to save it you just go ahead and tap the arrow right there to save it to the camera roll of your device if we go back and slide from here you can see we have a search bar right there where you can search for any keyword that you want and then you can also see the new wallpapers the best wallpapers or any wallpapers that you might have favored it and then you have here a ton of different categories to choose from so just go ahead pick any category and it will show you the list of wallpapers from that category that you choose if you go here you can go ahead and change the order from random to the newest one so by date or by random just tap right there and last but not least is an app called fonts this app allows you to type using your keyboard in a lot of different fonts so the first thing you will need to do after you install this app is go to settings go to general and then go to keyboard Go to keyboards right here, click on add new keyboard and just find fonts and you will be able to add it to the keyboard of your iPhone. Then once you're done, you can go ahead and just tap the globe right here and change to the keyboard and you will see at the top right here, you will have a list of a few different fonts that you can choose from. So you can see right here, just choose the font and the keyboard is very similar to the stock one. Nothing will change except the font right here when you're typing. So you can use this. It will be really, really fun to type on your social media or anywhere you want using these awesome fonts. And you can see how easy it is, how easy it is going ahead and switching fonts from here. So that's really, really cool. So you can see a ton of fonts to choose from.
So that is it for this video guys, these are my top 10 must have apps of 2019. In this video I have only shown free apps that can be downloaded of course for free from the app store. So these are apps that are very very useful and you must try them on your device. Hopefully some of them you will make a lot of use of. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I want to make more videos like this on apps. The next one will be the best free apps of 2019. So if you have any suggestions, make sure you leave them right down below in the comment section. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go ahead and subscribe for more videos like this. And I'll see you guys on the next one.